Just, just saying. Verse 13. For you were called to be free. Here's that word again. Called to be free, brothers and sisters. Only don't use this freedom as an opportunity for the flesh, but serve one another through love. And so Paul talks about this elsewhere, too. That we're not to sin because of grace. By no means. But here he's saying, don't use your freedom as a free license to gratify, gratify the flesh. Yeah. Use that freedom to love one another. To love your neighbor as yourself. To walk in that grace, in that mercy, and show others the love of Christ. And then, yeah, verse 14. For the whole law is fulfilled in one statement. Love your neighbor as yourself. Because that's the greatest commandment only after loving God, right? Love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, and mind, and spirit. The second to this, the second only is this, love your neighbor as yourself. Because if I'm loving my neighbor, I'm not going to be doing all the other things to break God's law. I'm not going to be coveting. I'm not going to be stealing his wife. I'm not going to be taking his horse. I'm not going to be uh, doing all these things if I love, love my neighbor as myself. And then he closes it out in verse 15. But if you bite and devour one another, watch out, or you will be consumed by one another. There's that thing of, again, if you do just a little bit, it's going to take over. If you love one another, let love be the sourdough starter in our church. Not heresy, not bad teaching, not bad doctrine, not circumcision, but let love be the thing that consumes us. Let us walk out of here full of grace, love, mercy, and love those around us. Love those who are difficult to love. Why? Because Christ tells us to. Because he loves us. Just like that verse says, it says that uh, while we were still sinners, yeah. not once I gained circumcision, once I fulfilled the law, then Christ died for me, but yet while we were still sinners, Christ died for me. Right. And that's love. That's the love that we should take out and love the community, love those around us, love our family. Amen. Sometimes, hey, sometimes families are to love. Love them well because of the cross. Love them when they don't deserve it. Love them like Jesus loves us. So you were called to be free. This isn't a license to sin, but yet to serve one another in that freedom and love. And instead, love because Christ loved us.